Hello everyone, welcome back to another English online session. Today, I am going to narrate the balance part of the chapter Discovering Tut, the saga continues. I have already given you the details about the writer. Now, let me give you a brief outline of the previous class. Then, I will start narrating the balance part of the uh, summary. Here, this chapter is about uh, Tut, the last pharaoh, the powerful dynasty ruled in Egypt. The question is how he died. His death was a mystery. Nobody knew that uh, it was uh, uh, what it, it is uh, natural or someone murdered him. That's why these all this investigation going on. It's all started when uh, Howard Carter, a British archaeologist, found the body of uh, Tut. Uh, and he started his uh, research. Later it was found uh, that uh, Howard Carter had uh, done some damages in his, while he was researching the mummy and it was a uh, serious uh, damage. Uh, it was uh, reported by Saki Kawas uh, later and uh, they have x-rayed this mummy and uh, found that uh, some ribs bone were missing and it, it was broken and missing now with the advancement of technology ct scan or computed uh, tomography can give a virtual image of the whole body with the help of this technology king tut's body would be scanned uh, to find answers uh, to two questions how he died and how old he at the time of his death his death was a shock to the royals also as uh, he was the last person of his family and his funeral indicated that uh, diminishment of his dynasty. However, what happened after his death is still not clear. Tut's father or grandfather Amenhotep uh, III was very powerful pharaoh who ruled over the period of 40 years his son Amenhotep IV succeeded him and began the strangest period in the history of Egypt. He promoted the worship of Athan, the sun disk. Here are these lines explaining the history of this particular dynasty. Uh, his father, grandfather, about uh, their uh, time, period of uh, reign and also a strangest period, nothing much uh, known about uh, this uh, time. It was believed uh, Amenhotep uh, IV uh, ruled over that time and uh, he just changed uh, the worship of God. He then changed his name to Akhenaten, meaning servant of uh, Athan. He also shifted the religious capital from Thebes to the new city of uh, Akhenaten called Amarna. Further, he attacked Amun, a god smashed his images and uh, closed his temples. Ray Johnson, a director of the University of Chicago, said it must have been a bad time for the empire as the family who ruled for centuries came to an end. And Akhenaten moved in an old direction. Another mysterious ruler, Smenker, succeeded him and uh, died soon. Next, uh, Tutankhamun, also known as Tut, uh, sat on the throne and ruled for nine years. He worshipped god Amun in the old ways. However, he died uh, mysteriously. Tut is the one of the mummies in Egypt, whereas until now, with the help of the Egyptian mummy project, which started in 2003, almost 600 mummies have been recorded so far. King Tut's mummy was the first one to be scanned by CT under the uh, next phase of scanning. The mummies with the mission donated by the National Geographic Society and Siemens. The CT scan uh, mission scanned the body by creating 1,700 digital X-rays in cross sections. 
Tut's head was scanned in 0.62 mm slices to record the tiny details. The resulting image was very strange. A team of uh, radiology, forensics and uh, anatomy experts uh, started examining the secrets of the grave that had been protected by flying goddess for a long time. So these uh, research fellows used uh, almost all the latest technologies to identify what exactly happened to him. During the night, a workman climbed up on the ramp and uh, flight of the stairs to carry the body from the tomb into the spinning sand outside. They rose the body onto a hydraulic lift, then into a trailer where the scanner was kept. After 20 minutes, two men ran towards the office nearby to bring two fans. The scanner was not working as the sand had entered a cooler fan. The guard uh, joked that uh, it was because of the curse of the furrow because they had removed his body. The data was uh, checked in case of any losses and then technicians returned the body to the Paul Beerus uh, who carried him uh, back to his tomb. So here are these lines explaining about uh, the process, uh, how they scanned the mummy and a particular thing happened and uh, the sand entered in the scanning machine and it uh, stopped the procedure for some time and uh, the guard even joked that it is the curse of this uh, uh, they believe a curse uh, fall upon whoever disturb the sleep or the rest of this uh, mummy uh, this tut uh, so they just joke to such things but they have completed this uh, uh, procedure and taken back to the mummy into its tomb in less than three hours he was resting at the same place where the priest had laid him many years ago in the trailer the technician showed a beautiful image of tut on a computer screen he showed the gray head which was uh, scattered in uh, pixels and he spun it around Next, uh, the vertebrae, hand, rib, cage and uh, transection of his skull were shown. As the work was done, the pressure was finally off from the shoulders of Shaggy Hawass. While sitting in his chair, he smiled and said that he was relieved that uh, nothing went wrong. He had not slept the previous night and now, as the work was done, he would go and sleep. By the time they left the trailer, the wind had stopped and the win winter air was like death itself. Just above the tomb, the Orion constellation uh, shone in the night sky, watching over the boy. Here, uh, this is the documentary about uh, the life or the mysteries behind uh, the death of uh, Tut. Yeah, very young king he unfortunately died a very young age he was the last ruler of the dynasty the powerful uh, dynasty pharaoh dynasty but still they are searching what exactly happened to him you can uh, find uh, articles uh, videos related to this excavation everything you can uh, find in the internet if you are interested you can go through it very recently some of the jewels and other things uh, actioned by the government and uh, now just uh, go through the text carefully many words you may face as new words just uh, find the meaning from the dictionary write it nearby that and uh, see you in the next class Bye.